Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're back on the RS2000, but unfortunately, we've done a bit of a fail. Now, if you're wondering why we've failed, if you saw the last video, you'll have seen us replace this inner arch and this chassis leg. But for the second time, we said we'd have it on a rotisserie. Now, we've found more corrosion here and more corrosion down here. And I'm gonna guess there is hidden corrosion as well. So we're gonna replace this inner arch. We do have a new one, they're ready. So the wing's gonna come off, then the inner arch is gonna come out, and then we're gonna put a new arch on. Thankfully, this inner chassis leg is good. So we're just gonna replace the inner arch and the battery tray, and then Hopefully, we're gonna put it on a rotisserie in the next video. Now I'd like to take this opportunity to thank Artec Welding Equipment. Now the previously sent us a welder on a trolley, an air-fed welding mask, and now the sent us a plasma cutter also with a trolley. So don't forget to visit their link in the description below. Okay, so at this point, I just wanted to use my new toy, a plasma cutter. Now, I hadn't read the manual. There was too much sealant in between and it was way too dirty. So not an ideal situation. So that didn't work out.
Right, so fail number two is this chassis leg. Now on the inside of the engine bay, when this inner wing was on, um, it looked good, but it's obviously not. There's a lot of corrosion uh, here, here, down here. Um, so we've had a word with the customer, instead of us repairing it, he's gonna send us another one. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna brace across the bottom here with anything we've got, bit of metal, doesn't really matter. Uh, when we're gonna chop it out. Right, so we decided not to brace the bottom of this because the bracing would have got in the way of us cutting the chassis leg out. So what we decided to do was measure all the key points so that when we offered the new chassis rail in place, we could check all those measurements before welding it.
Well, that's it for this video, guys. Two fails. One, not on the rotisserie. Two, chassis arm that we thought was good. In this next episode, we're going to be repairing these sections we've got, these pinholes, this top corner, getting the chassis rail in, because we have got the customer sending another one, and hopefully getting this inner wing in. So if you've enjoyed the video, leave us a like and smash that subscribe button. Till then, we will see you in the next one.